Steam Series, championed by your Southern California Toyota dealers. It's time for this week's STEAM series, our focus, engineering and art. Today, you're going to meet a dynamic duo who's built a she shed empire. I would never have pictured myself building she sheds for a living. Yet that's exactly what Erica Cotide of Laguna Hills has found herself doing. She and her partner, Sabrina Contreras, are owners of She Shed Living. This yeah. one's going to be a lot of fun. They make their living creating spaces like this. A she shed is basically an outbuilding, an accessory structure in your backyard. But in contrast with a storage shed designed to house equipment or tools. No windows, solid door. A she she shed is designed for something else. A place you can actually hang out in and do all the things that you love in. Erica studied literature in college. Her goal to become a writer. She found plenty of work editing shelter magazines, Victorian homes and romantic homes. And I found myself more excited about the outbuildings than I was about the house itself. So she started writing books about those outbuildings she loved and in the process learned how to design and build them herself. I actually took lessons to help me hone my basic skills using saws and power drills and measuring properly. Together with her partner, she started formulating new material combos and their own brand of color schemes. Love that. Yeah, this yep, that this works is a too. great color. Before long, loungers were in place. Tiny fireplaces were installed. The outgrowth of their brainstorming started to become reality. A new career path took shape. Of all the STEAM disciplines, designing and raising an accessory outbuilding relies most on engineering and art. We use very basic engineering. I will sometimes consult with engineers who I know to help me with simple formulas. Erica says the art of collaboration has also been critical. Partner Sabrina, an entrepreneur, helped her understand that to keep any business afloat. And you have to be a numbers person. Whatever you do in your life, measure it. As this dynamic duo reviews what went right or wrong in past projects and perfect new ideas for the next ones, Erica has this advice for creative young girls trying to identify a career path. Keep an open mind and know that there are so many niche businesses that you could cultivate that no one else has. The world is wide open for the things that you know and love best.